What have you got in your hands there? They're angle rods. Yeah. They're the last word in divining. For they're, divining. They're, water divining. Isn't yeah. It? Well, the fellow that just does water, he's not a diviner. He's a dowser. A dowser. The diviner is the last word in it. He'll find the drone bodies. I found now uh, Bob and Cara, they, they had given up. George Brennan was there, Sergeant Sullivan. But the fellow that was in charge, he knew I should do divining, but I landed with a load of nicks and I should deliver some there and then go on to mask. But, uh, when they came in empty handed and I asked them what part of the search in the town may but the other man went up, I said I went to large scale maps and he had them all right, he came down but I had to make instruments and I picked in this place out from Moore Hall. Yeah. And they said we're after searching that, Sergeant Sullivan said. Yeah. And I said, you didn't search it right. And I said, out straight from the four hedge there, forest straight and had it in about 14 feet of water. So down the went again, because they had to keep searching. And they were circled round and round. You can see down a long way in the water on Cara, it's clear. Yeah. And they were giving up again and just as they were coming out, Rory de Barra, the, the fishery of man, he saw a, like, something dark and stood it and it was the body. And, and how did you know it was there? You know, to see the, the, the maps, and I made, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I made the instruments, and uh, they kept crossing at, at that at that spot. And how does it work? Uh, the people don't know. Yeah, well, I don't know, no. And, uh, no one, and you know? The, no, the greatest experts. Mm -hmm. But uh, the girl then that was here, I said, uh, well, we'll see where you have this operation now. Don't tell me. And, uh, I got the thing in Asher and the head is straight, you know, it's part here. Yeah. And I came back again to it every time, this spot. Mm. And she said, that's so much for your rod. It's over here I'm having the operation. Yeah, this lady was sick, like she was, yeah. Yes. She had something wrong with her, yeah. Yes. Uh, and did she know what was wrong with her? I suppose they told her. Yeah, yeah. She's still in Westport. They come out yeah. now and again. Yeah. But uh, she went down to Queens and she had the operation here. Mm -hmm. As soon as she had it, an unbearable pain started here. Yeah. Couldn't control it to give her painkillers, everything. And the best that they had, surgeons and everything, came in. And they could find nothing wrong. They x rayed it. And it went to day, and a professor came in, and he thought then that he saw something that it might be just the start of a cyst. But they sent her to a pain clinic, and she has the pain yet in a lesser degree. Mm. But what did you think it was, or how? I, I have no knowledge of medicine. Yeah. But, but this, the, 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 the rods are pointing at, the yes, so, yes, at where it is sore. Yes, where they... But it won't tell you what's wrong. Just I know. It'll tell I'm, you where the problem is. You're right. I have uh, just uh, very little I know about medicine. Mm. Yeah, but uh, that... <laughs> <laughs> then uh, a man disappeared a few years ago on a Christmas night. He was a migratory labourer. The last he was seen was in Linen Hall Street. Mm -hmm. And he didn't go down where he was staying with the relatives. They searched, went to the guards then. The guards searched around the town. They searched forestry, they searched all around the town, and they searched along the river. No result. Yeah. And Checked in with English police, 
for his works in England and lodged and not there. Mm. And then they gave up. But I used to do the shop on that time in Westport, and there'd be nights uh, then that I'd have nothing to do. I'd take down maps and I just uh, thought of your man. Yeah. I had the very fine instruments and a uh, map. And, and, Give no reaction on the other place and just a faint reaction, just wish the bell of air. And were the instruments like this one here now? No, it yeah. had to be smaller. Smaller, yeah. To fit them a bit on the map. The finest, the, mm. the lower ones. Yeah, yeah. But I used to drink then, uh, have a pint in McGuire's, and there was a gas. Now, you must have known them in Westport, we used to drink a good bit. Mm. And I said, we used to be chatting. And, uh, and then I said, by the way, did you ever. Uh, and anything about that man that went missing? No, he said he disappeared into thin air. And I said, they don't do that. And well, he said yeah, the file is still open, but the chances of getting them. And then I told him what I had uh, found. Mm. And, uh, and, uh, that was on a Friday night, but the following Tuesday I heard on the radio Midwest that the missing body was lost. Just wished a bell of air. Well, that's the place you were pointed out on the map? Exactly the place. But uh, the next night that I went in, come over here. He says, after talking to you the, night, the other night, when I went in, uh, we'd have a get together before we go out on Tuesday, and I told them I was talking to a diviner in the pub, and he said that that man's body is west of Bellavere, along close to the river, along the river. And I said, I give him a slap in the back, and he said, if you believe everything you hear in a pub, and they had a great laugh yeah. about, uh, about his story, but he used to drive the squad car and he went down and said, and got it. And got it. He did. He said, I had my own back on them then after that. <laughs> but I was thankful that uh, he didn't uh, tell them the name of the man. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, if yeah. they started coming to you, and then. Uh, a lot of drugs are that found, they might think that it was me did it and get here further from them. And did you do much water divining? Oh, I, oh, I was even down Swinsford, and around Ballon Robe and, and in different places. Mm. But I had to study uh, the thing, I had to do uh, geology. Oh, okay. And um, is a, um, a difficult thing to get into. You get into. And you have to know the, uh, when, uh, you'd, uh, but you to know um, without looking sometimes where the the water it would be. Yeah. But then uh, I did uh, marine biology. That meant then the insects that's in the streams. Okay. I have a workable knowledge of that. Mm. There's a lot of strange mm. names in that. You and studied I, it all yourself, you did, yeah? Yeah, I got the books. Got the books and read it up, yeah. Uh, the library helped mm. a lot. There's things in there now. The community council uh, took something then uh, the uh, on the eye of the bridge, yes. mm. and when the... That was the, the, that was the book that came out? Yes, mm. and they were told uh, then uh, that uh, they had to uh, do the archaeology along the, the river, mm. along with the bridge, and what the bridge, the stones that it was made out of, uh, and, uh, and the flora and fauna. Mm. And, uh, that, the what I think is that after abandoning an engineer could uh, tell them uh, the type of stone that was in the 
the bread you put, uh, he'd have to stop there. He wouldn't know anything about these uh, insects that the fish feed on you, whether it was a trout stream or a, a coarse stream or a spade stream. And so there was, and she was uh, the principal of Kukul. She could teach uh, in second grade well. She was the first. She did the, the charum and she's a retired Noreen Gibbon, Noreen mm. Sadler. Yeah. It was laughable. Mm. She was on the bank and she, she had her arm the notebook and I'd shout up or something, Dytiscus Marginala, mm. spell it. Spell it, she uh, never yeah. Spell it, yeah. that. And, uh, and it, uh, so you give them a good hand at all this? The next thing might be Gamorous. Yeah. And, and so much of them are well in the plants. And it, uh, it, uh, I think uh, I forget which ones it was. Uh, I there wasn't much along that stream. Yeah. Where I did that, uh, I'd been for them. But they came then and they measured. Uh, the, mine was uh, an easier job, but there was mm. a lot of streams. And, uh, Mm. It was published, it's here at, at my back. Yeah. So you spent all your life looking at water and water life and all that, yeah? Yes. Yeah, in the fishery, they were in the fishery yeah, then. Yeah. Always that I have to I have the inquiring mind. Yep. And uh, it can lead you down difficult roads, but... Uh, and interesting. Yes, interesting. Mm. But I could... Uh, I could find uh, you now if, uh, we'd say, um, if I had a bit of your handwriting mm. and then you go missing, I'd find you mm. with, the, with the maps. Do they hope you don't have to be doing that for me? No, <laughs> um, I don't want to do it on anyone. The saddest place uh, that you can be uh, then uh, where I was. On the lake shore, the relatives there, the women crying, the fellas out, and them not having an idea. 